la wiki leo may 8 2020 e bana e make some noise kwa ngoma kwa ngoma ambayo hapo sasa hivyo kwa ngoma ambayo imekuwa hit alafu show hamna jamani how do you survive that my man yeah imagine um, imagine inaenda miaka mitatu sasa hivi sijafanya show na hii corona ina mwezi tu siyo yeah. i think yeah. swali lilikuwa umewezaje kuishi kwa miaka mitatu bwana wewe bila kuwa kwenye stage mm. and one thing for sure i'm telling you nyumba nayo kama magari nayo endesha na saidia watu na watoto na somesha kasta ma maid suit na shonesha na ishi maisha yangu na peace bila pressure na kama unataka kunchimba chimba mala sija na tinga na vimba na ringa go ahead sema uongo amna shida mwanao muona kwa una wivu na uchungu wa mimba ha kati ya ngoma zako zote zilizopo studio na ambazo umeshazitoa sio which one ni ngoma ambayo wewe mwenyewe unaiona kali kuliko zote uweza tumeisikia au bado hey, yes, yeah. <laughs> uh, unajua na kwanza leo imekuwa siku nzuri kwa sababu yeah tutatumia nafasi hii kuwaomba watu wangu ambao wananisikiza kupitia XXL uh-huh. wanisaidie kuchagua na tafutoa album wewe na nyimbo sio chini ya 18 uh-huh. but katika nyimbo ambazo wao wanazijua nataka kuzieka tatu tu so nataka yeah, wao wanichagulie yes. kuanzia sikatama mpaka i like it nyimbo gani tatu ni select ni zieke kwenye album yao i like it is definitely yeah, yeah. i like it lazima iwepo only yeah. nyimbo tatu nitachukua tatu tu yeah, mimi yangu sikatama hata mimi ningependa hiyo iwepo kwenye hivi ni kuaje ukikaa na show majozi i say it's like umekana na mina hapa mina huko na mami baby yani unasahau kumpa wapi acha noma straight i'm telling you like it kuna mistari na hakika show majandika mwenyewe umemwandikia but ni mwandishi mzuri sana wa nyimbo ndio lakini kwenye ile nitoke hapa nitakwenda wapi yule darasa kabisa si ndio that's true kwa sababu tulitaka flavor tu ya tofauti na lugha ambayo tumia but show majoz vibe vibe studio kuandika yule afanya kazi na wasichana wengi Yeah. Yeah. Ambapo yuko tayari kwenye kazi yake. Mm. Ahitaji mtu yeyote kumfanya awe tayari. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Nice. nice man. Ah uh, yeah. Shoma Josie uko live. Yeah man. Ya yeah, uko live kwenye Clouds FM, uko live pia kwenye Clouds TV. Yeah. Uh, kwenye Clouds Media Group uh, on YouTube channel yetu pia. Tell us a little bit about you kwa sababu nasikia umekulia msasani ulikaa sana kabla hujarudi South Africa. Ilikuwaje? Um for me kuishi Tanzania it, it's really the best thing that happened to me kwa sababu so nilizaliwa Afrika Kusini obviously alafu nilikuwa na miaka 16 tumehamia huko so nikaishi bonde la Mpunga bwana <laughs> <laughs> and nikasoma uh, hapo and it was such, it was a great place alafu sasa hivi um the fact ya kwamba naongea Kiswahili imenisaidia sana kwenye muziki kwenye kila kitu so sielewi si, si kabisa kama wasaili wakiwa wa, wa, you know embarrassed or, wa, kama wataki kuongea Kiswahili kwa sababu for me yeah. yani imenifikia mbali mbali sana sana that's good okay yeah. okay angalia my biggest songs ni ambazo ni lugha ya Kiswahili so, yeah. big song nambia na John Cena you know so so mimi yani kuishi Tanzania it has also helped me kwamba sasa hivi naongea Kiswahili and that's a language amba, that I really love to make music yeah. una, una mpango wote wa kurudi kuishi Tanzania labda hapo baadaye <laughs> ningependa lakini shida nilikuwa mtundu sana like nikisha hapo za kurudi yeah nafanya yeah. vitu vingi sana <laughs> Bado <laughs> tunapokea watundu lakini chama jozi hiyo inaruhusu eh tunaruhusu but but mentor mrudisha ngoja corona ishi atakuwa na tua kubwa bongo oh! Oh! Nice breaking news Yeah Shoma uh, Josie kesho ni birthday yako na hatutakuwa live na wewe so maybe we can celebrate it leo na utueleze yeah. umepanga nini kwenye mwaka wako mpya 
Unatimiza umri gani kesho? Um so kesho nimepanga ku I mean <laughs> ndafanya nini kwa sababu hapa sasa tuko jela hapa nyumbani so lakini um, nimesema kwamba fans zangu for my birthday um wavae kama shoma jozi nywele kila kitu watu wanajua rangi zangu kila kitu ninachofanya uh-huh. so they should dress up like me alafu wapige picha wa post using the hashtag shoma jozi day uh-huh. alafu nitakuwa nachagua the best ones the funny ones Uh, watu ambao kweli wanafanana like my twins yani kila kitu alafu i'll be giving away prizes and stuff yeah amazing amazing happy early birthday wishes kutoka team sure. double xl yeah, for advance yeah kabisa we wish you nothing but the best in everything that you do big time yeah uh, wimbo wa i like it ambao umefanya na darasa leo ni song of the week it means kwamba ni ni, ni wimbo ambao umekubalika kinoma noma yani yeah, yeah. Ilikuwaaje kufanya kazi na darasa? Maana yeye darasa anazungumza tu kufanya kazi na wewe. Yeah, no. yeah. Um, so mimi umbo huu um aba mentumia. So aba katuma umbo alafu niliza what do you think? Nimesikiliza alafu I was like this is a hit kabisa. Mm-hmm. I was like yani the beat yenyewe imekuwa international sana. It's already a hit. Like it's such a good vibe song and by it makes you feel happy the moment that you hear it so nilimwambia i love the song so much so he was like good kwa sababu sisi tumependa ukiwa na verse on the song mm-hmm. so i was like awesome hata yani ukuuliza hata darasa this this took us maybe three or four days to record on the one day alafu tukisema labda tume record leo kesho kutwa tuna shoot the video mm-hmm. Wow. Being in studio it was crazy. Wow, wow kuambia kwamba wamefanyaje kwa sababu studio it was a vibe but wow. The studio wali talking yana na rafiki zangu. Yaani the next day nikasikia mambo mengi sana and it was Yeah, yeah. God, God. Anatoba. Papa kama ni expose. No no no. No no no. we having fun, yo. <laughs> yeah, no, having fun, man. Like these guys are such a vibe. When you studio outside of studio shooting yeah. the video every time it was a good time and I appreciate it like honestly Darasa like uh, you know I appreciate it so much because sababu to me enjoy sana and also mimi nilikuwa nataka watu wansikie kwenye beat nyingine sio kila siku mm. like boom cafe to so i wanted to hear people hearing me rap when you like nimbo tofauti tofauti so for me it was, it was fun and and nashukuru sana yeah Amazing. very nice very nice uh natamani kujua the way ambavyo ulijisikia siku zile ambapo John Cena alitokezea na kuletwa kwako as a surprise <laughs> I think at mgeangalia uh, video wenyewe mtaona kwamba I was crazy. <laughs> I was and kweli nilikuwa surprised sana because I think Kelly Clarkson mwenyewe alisema hayupo John Cena. Hawana budget ya kumleta. So I was not expecting that. Mhm. Ah, jamaa katokea. I was shocked. <laughs> <laughs> na na shama na kuona kwenye tangazo la WWE umepataje huo mchongo? Ama ni John Cena ndo kakulink. Kaku <laughs> Wimbo huu yani umemfikisha mbali wow. sana mbali. Mm-hmm. Mbali mbali sana. Obviously mm-hmm. nikitoa huo wimbo um people became excited about WWE tena kwa sababu sisi tumeangalia WWE toka zamani, toka mm-hmm. zamani. So, you know um so so ilianza yani watu wakaanza kuwa excited all over again um about WWE so super sport and DSTV called me they're like yo we need you on this advert kwa sababu you've made wrestling exciting again so yeah. tunakuhitaji on this advert um we shot the advert and like yo what an amazing opportunity amazing uh soma mimi nataka kufahamu kitu kimoja. Yeah. Uh, unatumia lugha ya Kiswahili kwenye nyimbo zako na nimeona yeah. unapata pia airtime nzuri sana South Africa. 
Wameshaeka chini yeah. na kukuuliza bana Kiswahili namna gani vipi tufundishe? Are they excited? Are they like it au yani? So so um to look to learn when you show more than that darasa unakumbuka darasa when we went to that yeah. show in Joburg. Yeah, sure. So everyone in South Africa wanaimba kabisa Kiswahili. Yeah. Nikisema oh. wana. Yeah, and I'm telling you like, like, bonge la perform. Ah. <laughs> As that day, that was a crazy, mm-hmm. crazy one. Mm-hmm. So what you want to say, you know, even if you are not a child, but 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 you are not a child, the whole thing. And I was a child because I did it for, I was a child for a child, you know, I was a child for a child for a child, and I was a child for a child. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, 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 like the farm kwamba ingefika and to the point ambayo inajulikana sana South Africa it became a big song in South Africa mm. kila mtu anajua maneno wote on that song um so obviously wananuliza what is the meaning what 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 alafu nawaambia so nafikiri kama nawafundisha na yani nafundisha Afrika Kusini Kiswahili kabisa dunia unaifundisha dunia boyfriend wako anazungumza maneno mangapi ya Kiswahili That's a tricky one. <laughs> tricky. No, I'm 100% single. Um Excuse me. Right now. Me? Yeah. I'm ready yes. to mingle. Wow, I'm kidding. Kutoma picha nini? Una, ni mnachoma picha. But show, show me why you single. Watu wengi wana wana boyfriends, wana girlfriends, wao uko single kwa sababu gani? Is it a choice? au umekosa mchumba ama hakuna mtu anakupenda na yani corona imearuko mambo mingi yani yani corona yani corona corona kweli ni issue eh kwa corona imeenda na boyfriend wako Kabisa. <laughs> <laughs> uh, unafikiri darasa tutegemea labda kolabo nyingine we na Shoma Jozi labda. Uh, kwa, 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 kwa kwa msichana special kama yeye kwa mm. talent ambayo yuko nayo ambavyo ana behave ana treat watu pengine ambayo amekutana nao first time au ambao wako sikia. Sure. Yes, naweza kufanya na shot. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Ki, ki, watu ambao tayari wamefanya kazi na Shoma Jozi mm. wanazungumza positive things sana kuhusiana na yeye. Yaani yeah. utasikia da ni mtu poa, ana noma. Hata mimi jinsi ambavyo nimewasiliana naye mpaka na hii interview imekuja kufanyika it yeah. was just easy like that. She's humble. Yeah, she's humble. Uh, I think hiyo kitu yake amepewa hiyo. Mimi mwenyewe nimeiona hiyo na mpaka nimeondoka nayo hiyo kitu. Kafanya mm. kafanya katupa time yake, katupa love yake, katupa uwepo wake, acha tu studio, acha tu kwenye location, but ilikuwa ku treat ba nyinyi artist mini artist tumekutana same nyinyi mko mbali na nyumbani then mimi ni familia mm. vibe uh, so ni mtopoa sana yeah ni vibe linaonekana hata ukiangalia ile yeah. video ukimwangalia unamjua yuko hapo wewe mtu ametoka kona na John Cena lakini yuko hapo na chat na watanzania how do you stay so humble unajua wewe umetoka yani wewe umetoka yani wanataka kuvimbia yani maisha umeyapatia wanataka uvimbe yani wewe ni unakata Kelly Clarkson na John Cena how do you stay so humble shoma I mean <laughs> I think for me kwa sababu siwezi kusahau kwamba ni watu ambao wamenifikisha hapa mm. ndio fika leo like you know watu ambao walikuwa wamenipa wame nafasi wasanii wengine ambao wamenipa um, features wamenipa opportunities hata darasa kila sema ambao ana, anaenda anasema oh shoma jozi this is shoma jozi na yeye anatangaza so I have I will never forget kwamba sijafika peke yangu hapa nimefika kwa sababu watu wengi wamenisaidia wamenipenda amazing umetisha na darasa kwa upande wako ngoma ya i like it over fire na shoma jozi naamini ulifanya kwa expectations ya kufikia hadhira fulani ama audience fulani mm. unahisi mafanikio ya ngoma yamekufikisha kwa watu ambao labda walikuwa mwanzo cuz yeye ni international na wewe ni international pia lakini anafahamika south africa na huko na huko nini Yaani yeah. yeah. kuna sehemu umefika ambapo ulikuwa unategemea kufika kwa, kwa kutumia I like it. Of course kwanza 
Uh, ni ni kusaisha pale mimi sinaga daraja kwenye mziki wangu mimi nasengeza mm. mziki ambao anaohakika mtu mdogo mtu mzima mtu wa nchi yoyote akipata nafasi ya kukaa akasikiza uh. atapenda vibe flow hata kama elewi maneno mm. atapenda vibe ya beat hata kwa sababu nataka kutengeneza mziki wangu kuwa wangu kuwa so nyumbani kuwa so mimi mm. so kwa kwa kwa, kwa nafasi ambayo nimefanya nime, nime kwa ambayo nimefanya na Shoma Jose Shoma Jose ana watu wake ana ana obvious wamekuwa wameangalia nyimbo yangu wamesogea kwangu mm. so imeleta maana kubwa kwenye soko langu ambalo niko nalo na ambacho nimekitengeneza mm. kumbe nice. yeah. so, yeah. shoma jozi uh, dunia nzima sasa hivi imeathirika na ugonjwa wa corona i mean ugonjwa wa covid 19 unasababishwa na virusi vya corona yeah. ni jinsi gani ambavyo wewe unaweza ku survive kwenye hii ukaweza kutengeneza pesa kwa njia nyingine kwa sababu naamini hakuna tena performances kwa, kwa, kwa sasa hivi yeah, how do you survive um si tuna bahati kwa sababu kuna brand nyingi ambazo uh, bado wanataka kufanya campaigns na sisi so uh, nilifanya wimbo about covid um, wimbo utatoka labda ujayo nimefanya live performances kwenye insta live Um, so bado kuna kazi kazi so for me sasa hivi niko relaxed uh, pia sina vitu vingi ambavyo uh, na, na vilipa kwa sababu <laughs> si tulikuwa tunatoka sana mm. so right now <laughs> kuna hela nyingi ambayo i'm saving it kwa sababu si endi same <laughs> amazing hivi <laughs> unajua hata mimi nimegundua kwamba nina save sana hela sasa hivi kwa sababu hamna yeah. save ya kwenda eh hey, na kuna vitu vya kufanya ushanielewa eh Uh, yeah. Kama kuna kula kula na kunyo kunyo <laughs> you know. <laughs> sasa sisi mpaka atuaruhusiwe kununua pombe sasa hivi. Wow. Kabisa. Kwa nini? Hata kama nyumbani. Siju, labda wana kana, kama like for afya yetu sio nzuri sijui lakini sasa mtu yani ataruhusiwa kabisa kununua. What do you use? So, to... okay. How how do you get hyped up? Yeah, you know. <laughs> you don't just relax. Come on, I'll give you a step by step for the song. Hey, relax. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> you have to relax in this yeah. time, you know. Yeah, so sure. yeah, you know I'm saving money. Lakini najua kwamba ni ngumu for watu wengi and uh, for me najaribu kuwapa watu um, opportunities wasanii wengine. Kwa mfano nilitoa nilitoa challenge moja kwenye Instagram yangu nikasema uh, nimeweka wimbo verse bila uh, beat. Bila beat, yeah. Yeah. So I said, okay guys, here's a song so for producers Uh, produce something alafu um nitachagua moja alafu i will i will give that person an opportunity yani nataka labda wasanii ambao labda hawajulikani sana na nini ni wape nafasi na an opportunity mm. as well uh, my dancers nikitoa hiyo nyimbo nitajaribu ku uh ku, ku, ku alipa, labda my dancers wafanye videos and stuff like that then najaribu mimi pia ku support wasanii wengine safi sana um because, because yeah it, it, it's, it's a difficult time mm. yeah uh shuma jozi mwana thanks so much for your time na darasa hapa ametuambia ana drop album we mpango wako ukoje Oh yeah so for me nina this song ambayo nili nilifanya this challenge so nitatoa hiyo nitatoa hiyo single it uh, um labda wiki jao in the next two weeks after to push your single and then later the year nitatoa album yangu mm-hmm. so yeah we'll see before <laughs> like before... me uh, he... yeah Na no, saying before Shoma Jose goes kabla kabla hujaondoka ningeomba tukuimbie happy birthday so that we take a video kwa ajili ya kushare kesho siku ya birthday yako kwenye platforms za clouds itakuwa poa. Mm. But, <laughs> ah okay. Yes. Uh, ulikuwa unasema if you have anything to say kwa fans wako hapa Bongo wanakusikiliza right now kwenye Double XL it's your time yo. Uh, first of all I want to say asante sana sana sana. Kuri maswa ima.